Security alarm system! Do it yourself. Well, you'll have to do it yourself, because I wouldn't know where to start. You're me, Smith. Aha, uh -huh, but I would. Any old idiot could put this lot together. Come on, boys, you can give me a hand. Um, is that a good idea, do you think? I don't know, but he says it's easy. He says any old idiot could do it. Yes, but he's not just any old idiot, is he? He's Richard. Well, I have to admit, it looks like Richard has made a good job of the security system. Mm, well, we haven't seen it working yet. Yeah, that's true. Well, at least he's got Sooty and Scampy helping him. Can I help? Yeah, if you could just pass me that hammer. Certainly. Got no. it! Oh, oh, it's all going very well. <laughs> Hello, sweet. We don't need an alarm. Why? What do we need instead? <laughs> a guard dog? Hey, yeah, that's a good idea. Now, where would we find one? There's one very near. Well, I hope not. I'm scared of guard dogs. How's it going, Richard? It's ready. Prepare to be amazed. Well, how does it work? Well, oh, it's simple. You see, if anyone tries to get in through the kitchen, the minute they open this door, this alarm bell will go off. Go on, then. Let's see it. Yes. No problem. Ready? Yep. Yes. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> saw it went off the wall and onto Richard's head. It's just teething troubles. <laughs> teething troubles. Yeah, he's putting his mouth more like. Mm. Hey, any idiot can fix a security system. I need you as well, Sue. Coming. <laughs> I'd better go. It obviously needs a woman's touch. Obviously. <laughs> hey, maybe you're right, sweep. Maybe we should have a guard dog. <laughs> Where would we find one? you trying to say? Of course, brilliant. The newspaper shop. We can put an advert in their window. Oh, thanks, sweet. You're a genius. Now, where's my pen? God, don't want it. Contact the Sunny Heights Hotel. No, Sonny, don't set it off yet. Don't touch anything. How's it going? Oh, I'm fine. Leave it alone, Sonny. Sounds it. I'm waiting for the phone to ring about the ad. Hello, sweep. What are you pretending to be? You a guard dog? Oh, yes. Hey, you look a bit like the soldiers who called the Queen at Buckingham Palace. Very good. Guard dog. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> Hello, Sooty Heights Hotel. Guard dog? <coughs> Certainly. <coughs> Come right over. Well, looks like we've got our first applicant. <laughs> Guard dog. <laughs> Very funny, sweet. You know, you should be on the telly. Guard dog. <laughs> <laughs> this all seems to be fine. Just got to check out this final connection. <laughs> That's not you, is it? <laughs> no, of course not. Sweep? Sweep, is that you? Sweep? Are you all right? Oh, you haven't been crying, have you? Oh, come on. 
Hey, do you want to, you know, talk about it? Liana? Yes, what about her? She won't let you be the guard dog? Oh, oh. Well, I could see why that would upset you. Then after all, you're a dog, aren't you? And guard dogs are dogs as well, so naturally you thought... <laughs> Sorry. Naturally, you would... <laughs> you... <laughs> I'm sorry, I... Why don't you help me test this alarm? That way we won't have to bother with a guard dog at all. <laughs> Sweep? Funny dog. Never mind, I'm right. If this alarm system works, we won't need a guard dog. Not even one like Sweep. I'll just make the final connection. <laughs> Maybe we do need a guard dog. <laughs> Should have seen the size of them, but it didn't bother me. I soon sent them back. Yes, yes, I'm, uh, I'm sure you did. Now, have you had any experience as a, as a guard dog? Rabbits. Rabbits? Yeah, that's no fun, I can tell you. Talk about snore, and you have to read them a bedtime story. Oh, I see, you've been guarding rabbits. Is that why you got straw in your hair? Boy, watch it. Don't touch. These hands are trained, you know. Are they? What in? Knitting, juggling, colouring in, you name it. Yes, well, I'm not really sure that, uh, you Neither know... am I, love. But I'll tell you what, I'll give it a go, and if I like it, I'll stay forever. Uh, <laughs> hey. No need to thank me. I'll get started. Fine. Thanks. Oh, no. Poor Liana. It looks like Butcher's just given himself the job. Sweet is not going to be happy. Neither are you. No, Sooty, neither am I. Yes, that's right, Sooty. Neither is Stampy. None of us is going to be happy. Maybe Richard will get the security system fixed and we won't need a guard dog after all. He's giving it a final tweak now. Oh, I don't believe it! Oh, I do. I think I've sorted out the security system. Just got to check the connections in the dining room. What's this? Security, mate. Can I see your pass? Pass? What pass? Security pass. Well, I haven't got one. Well, then you can't come through. What? I can't have every Tom, Dick and Harry wandering round the place willy-nilly. Uh, well, I'm not Tom, Dick or Harry, and I'm not willy or nilly. I'm Richard. Exactly. Dick, short for Richard. <laughs> if I let you through, what are Tom and Harry going to say? I am not Dick. I am Richard, and I work here. Well, that's not what I've heard. Look, I need to get in the dining room. Not without a pass, you don't. No pass, no get by. Oh, this is ridiculous. It's security, mate. <laughs> Some people, eh? Where's my security pass? I don't need one. I'm a guard dog. <laughs> right oh, in you go, sir. Yes, what is it? This is a security X-ray machine. Now, get in there. Oh, that was your bones, sir. No, they're his lunch. Did you pack your stomach yourself, sir? Well, of course he did. You don't have to spoon-feed sweep. Well, I might have to confiscate those bones for tests. Yes, what sort of tests? Well, uh, tasted tests, mostly. <laughs> You just want them for yourself. Well, you can't have them. They're in sweet stomach. You leave them alone. Oh, all right. Your turn, miss. You're not getting me in there. Why? Got something to hide, have we, miss? Hmm. She's got a black belt in karate. Uh, right. Uh, perhaps we'll give the X-ray a miss then, miss. Uh, just make sure you keep wearing your security badges. We might. Come on, boys. <sighs> It ain't easy being a security guard. Oh, drat.
Yes, Sooty, it is a pity that Sweet can't be the guard dog, but I can see why not, can't you? Oh, come on, don't get me wrong. Sweet's lovely, really lovely, but he's just not guard dog material at all in any way. And nothing is ever, ever going to change that. Ever. What? What are you saying? What? What? Oh, yes, obviously he gets a little bit of training. Oh, there you are, Sweet. Are you just saying that with a little bit of training you'd be the best guard dog in the whole world? Good idea, Sooty. OK, Sweet, let's start the training. What's going on here, eh? This attic is out of bounds for security reasons. Out you go, now. Oh, drat! Where can we go that's private? Smart thinking, Sooty. Is the door locked, Stampy? Good. Right, don't let anybody in. OK, Sweep, the two things that every guard dog needs are concentration. Are you listening, Sweep? Oh, good. Now, the two things you need are concentration, lightning reflexes, and you need to be able to tell the difference between a burglar and an innocent bystander. Three things. It's all right, don't be picky. So, let's see if you can tell the difference between a burglar and an innocent bystander. Now, Sooty is a burglar. Is he? Yes. Well, no, not really, just for the training. And Stampy is an innocent bystander. Obviously, that's just for the training as well. Now, can you tell the difference, Sweet? Good. What is it? Exactly, no. I mean, yes, I mean, Sooty's yellow, but that's, um... Oh, dear. This could take forever. Right, Sweet. Can you tell the difference between a burglar and an innocent bystander now? <laughs> the burglar's the one with the arrow. Well done. But let's see if you can tell the difference in the dark. Now, I'll put the light out and you... Burglar sweep, okay? Good. Grab that burglar! Ah! Ah! Sweep, get off! Now, uh, um, that's nearly right. Shall we try again? Will you hurry up in there? I want to use the bathroom. What do you want to use the bathroom for? What do you think? Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh. We've moved out of the bathroom, though everyone is exhausted. Wake up, Sweep! Right, do you know the difference between a burglar and an innocent bystander now? Good, at last. Now, let's test your reflexes. Wake up! Right, Sweep. Grab the burglar. Well done. Now, let's do it with the light off. Grab that burglar! Well done! Again! Grab the burglar! Again! Grab the burglar! Good idea! Night! Grab the How's the security system coming along? Well, it's a lot less sensitive than it was. It shouldn't go off accidentally. Mm, good. I don't be woken up in the middle of the night. Come to think of it, it's probably not such a good idea to eat cheese so late at night. Can give you dreams. What's going on here, eh? Did I say dreams make that nightmares? We're having supper. Too bad. You're supposed to be in bed. Who says? I says. It's security rules, OK? Everybody in bed by ten o'clock or else. I can't be expected to keep this place safe if you're wandering about for half the night. Now, look here. I... Leave it, Richard. Look, I'm too tired to argue. We'll sort it out in the morning. Good night. That's more like it. I'm going to lock up. And I don't expect you here when I come. Ah, not yawning, are you, Butch? 
No, just practising my menacing growl. Uh, a likely story. Still, I suppose Liana's right. We'll sort him out in the morning. <laughs> Better wash these plates up. While I'm at it, I think I'll polish off that trifle in the fridge. <laughs> oh, yes. Butch isn't going to tell me what to do. Good night. Oi! <laughs> Sorry. Sweep hasn't been eating cheese or trifle, but he can't sleep. Perhaps it's all the burglar training with no burglars to catch at the end of it. Sweep lies there, listening to the night. What's that? A burglar? Yes, it could be. With all his training, Sweep knows exactly what to do. No, not hide under the duvet. Grab the burglar. Really? Really, yes. So Sweep decides to go downstairs to investigate. You don't. You do. Now get going. When Sweep gets downstairs, he can hear the noise much more clearly. It's coming from the kitchen. There must be a burglar. But where's Butch? The burglars must have nobbled him, really? Suddenly, Sweep hears footsteps on the stairs to the kitchen. The burglar's coming nearer, and Sweep needs a plan. Squirting with soot is water pistol. Oh, that's such a good idea. Then run away? That's not such a good idea. It's time to show that burglar what I'm made of, thinks Sweep. No! Thinks Sweep. Sir, it was a false alarm. I'll get it fixed. Don't worry. Yeah. Good night. You know, there's one thing I don't understand. Where's Butch been all this time? Yes, with all that noise going on. I mean, you'd have Yes, thought that... all right, Sue. I take the point. Well, mystery solved. He's asleep. Yes, sweet. He is asleep. Well spotted. All that training wasn't wasted after all. Wake up! What? What? Where's the fire? Where's the burglar, more like, Butch? Burglar? What burglar? We can't have a guard dog that sleeps on the job. I'm afraid we're going to have to let you go. Let me go? Let me go? Try and stop me. I'm off. Burglars indeed. Whatever next? Well, sweet. It looks like you can be our guard dog after all. What do you say? There's your answer, Sue. Sweep's too fond of his sleep to guard anything. Looks like we'll have to get a proper alarm system after all. Just as long as Richard doesn't build it. There's nothing wrong with this alarm system. It just needs a, a little adjustment. 